Hello Protect Geniuses. As you can see, I got my iPhone updated to the latest version that is iOS 26.1. And after this update, as you can see, my phone has become just too damn ugly. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can change your entire iPhone aesthetic to look like a minimal iOS dark setup. At the end of this video, your iPhone would look like this. want to change your iPhone look then make sure to watch this video until the end. Now oh, this can be achieved in three easy steps. Step one is to go to your settings and customizing your lock screen and home screen. In order to do that scroll down all the way to the wallpaper settings. Here just click on add new wallpaper. Here click on the color option. Just choose black as your color. Now, after choosing black as your color, just scroll all the way to the right until you see solid. Now, in the time, just extend the time, click on the time and just make it slim as much as you can. And by default, you would have the glass selected, just make sure to click on the solid. Once you are done with this, you can just click on add and you need to set it as a wallpaper pair. After setting it as the wallpaper pair, as you can see, this is how my wallpaper looks right now. And now the next step is to turn on the dark, dark mode. In order to turn on the dark mode, all you got to do is navigate to your control center, long press it and click on add a control. Here if you scroll down all the way to the bottom, you can see dark mode inside the display and brightness option. Now click on the dark mode and get it added. Once you have the dark mode turned on, your screen would look like this. Now the third step is to customize the icons. In order to customize icons, just long press on the screen, click on edit in the left side corner, click on customize. Now you can customize icons and their styles. Now first of all click on the sun to dim it and just click choose the clear style. In the clear style choose dark and make sure to big icons without labels so i hope this was clear just make sure this is how the setting looks once you do this this is how your iphone would look like